Oh, uh, yeah. And for my second case, it's Bam Bam, the X Factor for the Mayday Blood. Let me explain what I mean by this. There have been many conversations. Uh, shout out to Going Hard Twin. They had a discussion maybe last week or so talking about different uh, Mayday dogs that they were potentially looking at, you know, uh, different different ones, different strands of Mayday. And I just wanted to throw this one in because people who may not know who Bam Bam is, Southern Kennels Bam Bam is a little mate brother to Havana Boys champion Noriega. And Bam Bam, from my understanding, basically might have been just a yard dog for ACAR. But he ended up producing outstanding animals, you know, um, to the likes of, you know, dogs like Grand Champion, uh, Yellow Man, Champion Mongoose, uh, La Loca, two-time winner, Zeta, two-time winner, Santana, two-time winner. And there, of course, there are others, you know, I'm just reading from Pairs Online. There were many others. But I want to go back to Grand Champion Yellow Man, and I want to look at his pedigree, and I understand that there are still Yellow Man dogs in the world. Also, too, to look further down at Champion Ink Town's Brock, a.k.a. Caesar, four-time winner, one-time best in show. And also to look at a dog that I heard mentioned was the Green Bean. The Green Bean dog. Now, some of these dogs are difficult to come by depending on who you are and your uh, wittiness of, of networking and ability able to find these animals. There are also other strands that are not being talked about that I won't mention on this show of Bam Bam dogs doing even better than the yellow man strands. That is not for this show. But what I'm saying is there are other alternatives to tapping back into the Mayday blood. I encourage people to look at uh, Mel Kant's Screaming Demon, Champion Screaming Demon. Uh that blood on the top is Arca Combine blood, which doesn't hurt anything. The, the Yellow John, the, the Red Boy Jocko, Jeep, Chinaman Cross, basically is what it is. And, and they bred to a dog that was formerly uh, Gameville's Fatty Girl, uh, which is a heavy uh, Mayday dog, Havana Boys, uh, Joker on the bottom side type dog. That is another way you could tap in. The champion Mr. Serious Blood is another way you could tap in, which is still here in pockets. Uh, in, in some cases, you can find it heavy on the Serious, you know, through, uh, down through, uh, his grandmother Katana. Uh, that's another alternative that to tap back into the, to the Mayday without being a total outcross because it's bred into the Puncho blood, which is Bolio Tombstone, which goes is connected to the Hollingsworth, which is also Bolio Tombstone. So you're not leaving out of the family as much by using those animals. To tap back into the Mayday blood. You know, there are other alternatives out here, but I really believe that if people network in the right way, do the right research that Bam Bam's blood could very well be the X factor. Very well be the X factor. And, and I'm looking at Noriega and what he could have been as a producer. Those are two dogs in the Mayday world that I always have my questions about as far as what if. And the two dogs are Noriega and Champion 600. Um, If they had got a chance to live... Uh, for a long period of time and being able to produce what type of dogs would they have produced and would they have been a factor in expanding the Mayday brand or even furthermore reshaping I think two, those two dogs may have been two of the more better Mayday dogs you know a lot of people say Champion 600 was the best male 
we understand that a lot of females were were the really the best made it dogs they were the females but as far as males is concerned concerned you know, noriega in 600 they come up in 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 conversation as absolutely the best made it males and i know it's people that's going to disagree and, and that's all fine and well please put that those comments um in the chat and also comments under this video to let me know if not then who do you think and if you know any other ways that you could possibly tap into oh, oh yeah I, f I forget you know like champion morocco uh morocco uh over but he's he's i think he's in south america but dogs like that and we understand that also you got in mexico you have the the champion simplicio uh the uh his brother grand champion jesse those dogs are also dogs that could be brought back in uh to re um add vigor into the mayday dogs over here that may have been you know you know they gotta you know just like some cereal that that, that you left in the bowl for too long you know the milk made it soggy you, you know what i'm saying the blood line kind of getting soggy a little bit you might need to get you some, uh, you know, get you some hurry up or something, uh, before you mix it up, you know, because it's not as, you know, as all around as it used to be. A lot of the game is still there, but you know, some of them cotton mouth is on the way, but you know, but like I say, what do you say? Forget what I'm saying. What do you say? Could the Bam Bam Blood be the X Factor? Could Yellow Man play a part? Green Bean? Brock? And these dogs play a factor? And that's just where I'm going to leave it at. And for the case of... Could Bam Bam be the X Factor for the Mede dogs? This case is now dismissed.